My name is Tony Massengill. I'm from Catawba, North Carolina, and I run Buddy's Carts and Parts. My family has been in racing since 1971. My dad used to work for K and K Dodge NASCAR team, and my mom actually grew up next to a Bobby Isaac, who was a famous NASCAR champion. We grew up in racing, and we used to actually race dirt cars, late miles. I had a few younger nephews start go kart racing, and we started go kart racing. And I'd rather go kart race than do anything. Dirt track racing is like the roots racing of America to me. I worked in NASCAR for six and a half years. Flat dirt racing is, you know, it's, it's a poor man's sport, I guess you'd say. I mean, it really is to get into racing and everybody in kart racing is looking forward to moving somewhere else. I started like three and a half years ago, started with the parts thing, and then I met TJ Newton, this is TJ Newton Motorsports, and TJ took me under his wing and really helped me become what we are with the parts thing, because there's basically three shops here. The motor shop, radical racing engines, TJ Motorsports, and Buddy's Carts and Parts. We do anything here from scaling out to complete go-karts, to bodies, to seats, to this, we were talking earlier, this is a one-stop shop. You can come here, get a go-kart, get it lettered, get a motor, get tires and wheels, all the parts you need, leave here and go race the night and night. It's a one-stop shop. For drivers to be competitive in flat cart racing, dirt racing, um, it's, it, you, do, you have to have a, basically like a crew chief. You got to have somebody who can do tires and knows how to prep tires and go to the races with you. And, it's not a sport you just get into and go out there and run fast. It's not that simple. I like working with the young kids, um, watching them grow and, you know, they start out, you know, all of them do from nothing and watching them become what they become. We're all like a big family around here. Everybody's got motorhomes. We all travel together. Uh, we, you know, we go to a racetrack, we race, we play together. So it's, it's like one big family over here. Every kart racing, like I said, every little kid probably dreams of going to NASCAR, but we do have kids that leave and go modified dirt racing, late model dirt racing. Um, we have several very young kids, 11, 12, 13 year old, that have moved on from the kart racing to dirt late model racing and uh, sprint kart racing. So every goal, I, I, I would assume that most of them are looking to go to NASCAR, but the next step from here would be dirt cars, and we have several kids that have left and went, and they still come back and race the carts. I would, I would guess around here, a lot of kids like go to Callahan. That's where they start out around here, and you know, and venture out to some of the other tracks once they get more um, skilled. Yeah, you know, I think every little kid, if you interviewed them, is looking to go to NASCAR. That's harder nowadays than it ever been, but it's not impossible. So I think that's every little kid's dream.